It's March and I still haven't captured a winter Milky Way arch panorama this season. Hopefully this will change tonight. Welcome at Soriška Planina. This is a small ski center in northwestern Slovenia. And uh, besides skiing, this place is also popular for hiking throughout the whole year. It is actually quite a lovely place where you are surrounded by many peaks and uh, valleys. So it's basically like uh, walking between sand dunes, if I could say so. But of course, we didn't come here just for hiking. We are here to do some astrophotography. Uh, the sun is setting, we actually have some lovely color in the sky and uh, I think uh, I should do some scouting before I lose all the light. Let me give you a bit for an orientation where we are. That mountain right there. Uh, let's wait for focus. That's Porezen. So you probably know that one. And uh, towards the west, right uh, there in the middle, it, we have the highest mountain in Slovenia, Triglau. It is uh, quite windy today. So uh, we're gonna see if uh, we will have problems with tracking and so on. But uh, we still have a few hours because the moon is up and it will set around uh, 9.30. Also, if uh, everything uh, will go according to plan, a friend of mine will uh, join us tonight. Now I uh, checked the first composition it uh, looks uh, quite okay but uh, now I'll move to the other side over there because uh, I'd like to check uh, that peak uh, also so let's go let me show you one more thing it's uh, stuff like uh, this thing right, right here there are many bunkers trenches and uh, tunnels going underground and uh, you really have to be careful here in winter because uh, it can be quite uh, dangerous you can fall and uh, it would be quite difficult to get out
Okay, I think I found my foreground, basically the spot where I want to shoot my panel from. And uh, let me show you quickly. The Milky Way arch should uh, start somewhere there and it's gonna sweep across. And uh, somewhere there it uh, should uh, be the second uh, part of the Milky Way arch. I found those uh, rocks which are forming quite a interesting circle and uh, in the middle I will have that uh, peak right over there. Uh, I hope the wind, wind uh, will die down just a little bit because if it stays like it is now it's gonna be quite uh, a challenge to work with. So. Stefano just joined me. He's an uh, Italian living and working in Slovenia. That's correct. Yeah. Hey guys. Um, should we have high hopes or low expectations for tonight? I think it's gonna be quite cool. I think so too. So uh, let's wait. Uh, I don't know two more hours. Yeah. And fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. And uh, hope for the best. And sorry for breaking hard. I just arrived. <laughs> he just arrived. So. <laughs> It's uh, quite a challenging hike up here, actually, especially with snow and so on. So, especially if you're not Slovenian too. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, let's wait. I'm all set up, but it's freaking cold and windy. So uh, let's go over the setup, the gear and the uh, filters we'll use tonight. Most of you will probably already know this setup. For tracking, I'll use Move Shoot Move Nomad. For imaging, I'll use Astro Modified Nikon Z6. And uh, the lens is going to be Wiltrox 16 mm But uh, as you can see, at the moment, I've attached Sigma 28 mm because I'm using Wiltrox for vlogging. And uh, just like my setup, the filters are also becoming quite a classic for me. The first one is Astronomic 12 nanometers clipping filter to capture isolated H-alpha signal. And uh, the second one is Prosoftom A made by Kanko because I want to have nice star glow effect on my image. By the way, Stefano is over at the first location we scouted while I'm here at the second spot, which, as you have seen, I ended up liking more.
looks like we are done here for tonight. I can't wait for heated seats in my car. Anyway, I would like to say thank you to Stefano for joining me. And of course, thank you for joining us on this uh, little winter adventure. I hope you enjoyed it and that the images turned out great. And uh, you know, let's uh, wait for the next one. And uh, until then, take care and bye-bye. Uh,